I've got raw bison bone and tendons here. Look at this. <laughs> got these from the Mokoche Agriculture Development Team. They were a group of indigenous people that were showing the locals up north how to butcher and utilize a full bison. They butchered two bison and they're going to be utilizing the entire animal. I had the amazing opportunity to go up north and help them out with this. When I got there, they had all eight quarters brought in and they were enormous. And I helped like cut off the meat off of the bone. And I got to separate like the tendons and the bones from each other. And I learned so much from them. And it's really, really incredible. So they gave me some stuff to bring home and I'm going to be making these in a tools or eating it. Like the larger bone here, I could turn into like a scraping or flushing tool. The tendons, I could probably dry and then turn into like sinew or rope. These bones here has a bunch of bone marrow that you can eat, but then I can turn these into like needles also. I have a roast and I also have a bison toe. I have so much footage and I need to like compile everything and, and get that together, but I just want to thank the Red Lake Nation for having me, the Lakota and the Ojibwe tribes. And the Makoche Agriculture Development, they were the ones who kind of initiated all of this and, and made all of this possible. <laughs> so thank you very much for all of this. I learned a ton.